absolutely no idea what today's vlog is going to be about. <laughs> I just wanted to record a video. <laughs> Having a play date with one of Alexander's preschool friends. Dad duty. It's currently 28 degrees outside in the shade. Gonna be even hotter tomorrow. But play date went well. <laughs> it is incredible how tired one can get after being outside for an entire day with your kid. <laughs> I'm, I'm blown away. And especially when it's this warm because you feel fatigued just by being outside. And I know that there's a heat wave across Europe right now and um, one thing that I invested in last summer or I think the summer before that because it was so incredibly hot was this portable AC unit right here and this has saved us so many times. Since we're living in this tiny apartment and only have the windows on one side of the apartment, there's no cross flow of the air. It's just dead. And with this unit, you just place it where you want it to be and then take this tube, put it outside, all the hot air is going out, the compressor does its thing and out comes the cooled air, just like a real AC unit. If you're thinking about buying one of these, cannot recommend it enough. We're gonna travel to Mallorca in a few days and we don't have a big, what do you call them? Suitcase, travel bag, luggage bag. Mission traveling suitcase accomplished. Perfect fit. We bought a new bed a while back, then you got one of these for free. I have no idea if this is good, but our best portable Bluetooth speaker. Sounds like a good thing. I was not really supposed to go to the studio today, but I managed to bring my dad's keys with me home yesterday and he didn't have any spare keys so i had to go back today and give him the keys so that he can have access to his workshop and i mean i do enjoy being here it's 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 my man cave but today it is incredibly hot i want to talk a little bit about this again because this might just be one of the best things that i've used as a filmmaker vlogger videographer on the go shooter if you may. You probably already know about the capture clip that I've talked about previously that I got in my camera bag so that I can strap my camera to my camera bag whenever I'm on the go. This is something that is incredibly useful when you're doing a lot of vlogs and then you're just like, okay, I'm just gonna need my hands, hands free here. So I put it there and then you can access it by the press of a button, simple as that. It's the same thing but for your belt. The first thing that I was really worried about was if it comes loose, because you don't want your camera to fall off, right? If it does, <sighs> the security of this is actually kind of ingenious because it can't come off in any way or form when the camera is hanging there. This is called the Peak Design Pro Pad. So you take the capture clip, you put it through like so, and then you fold this over, you put in the screw, which keep the entire locking mechanism from falling off. Your camera weighs this down, but this can't get anywhere. It can't fall off. It's impossible for it because the camera's weight is gonna lock this in place even more. And once you put it on your belt, it's gonna be impossible for the camera to fall off together with this. Doesn't matter how much you try to get it off, it's gonna be stuck there. Jumping, no worries at all. It's there, hip. As long as your belt can handle it, this is gonna be stuck to this. So if you're anything like me and you wanna have easy, quick storage for your camera, this is your thing. I cannot praise this enough. I'm not sponsored by Peak Design. It's just a product that I really enjoy using. It gets 
incredibly hot in this office because we are in an attic space even though we have pretty good insulation but this area like this space which is my main office is kind of a bad example this however though way better insulation much cooler that an oven bye bye wise words of today the sun is shining and it's hot and warm but don't stay too long in the sun still have an incredible training ache <sighs> one of the best things to combat training ache is actually working out don't believe me give it a try so incredibly out of touch with the whole gym thing. I don't even register it on my watch anymore. The biomechanics of my body is not what it used to be. I'm having pain here in my knees and my joints and everywhere. I really do feel like an old man. The current status, I'm not nowhere near where I want to be, but as you know by the last time, it's gonna take time to get rid of the muffin top and get back a little bit of the fullness. Yeah.